Hey, I was having second thoughts about speaking into this machine about this because I'm on my second pint of the old pink elephant. <laughs> now, I'm not crazy, I'm not rip roaring drunk, I haven't done any coke or anything else, quaaludes or smoked weed or any other of those drugs that I read about in the um, science magazines. But I was thinking to myself, you know, isn't it funny? Even if I was uh, a, a, a drunk, uh, um, you know, when Dylan Thomas was was drunk, uh, was a drunk. He was a drunk. There's lots of drunks. I mean, the guy that uh, the actor, he's uh, I forget what his name. He's been in and out of rehabilitation for doing cocaine. Um, uh, Brendan Behan, brilliant, brilliant writer, was a drunk. But a plumber at East Bay Mud, if he if he if he if he's drunk, he's he's a he's a bum. The working working guy, if he he's, he gets drunk, he's a bum. Oh, he's a bum. Don't listen to him. You know that's a bit discriminatory, if you ask me. It's a bit of a class oppression there. Class oppression. Not that it's good to get drunk or anything like that. But you know how come you know he can you know Brendan Bean can be a genius. I knew lots of, I worked with a lot of guys that, uh, I'm reading that book, uh, almost finished it, um, The Ragged Trousered Philanthropist. A friend from England told me to read it years ago. It's a brilliant book. It's about a bunch of guys that are remodeling a house. It's a political book. Uh, but, um, you know, I think to myself, you know, isn't that something, you know? When the, when, when, when the average guy, I work with a lot of guys uh, uh, from every background, you know, uh, who, who uh, in ditches and uh, and we were called plumbers. My son laughs at me if, if I say that because he is actual plumber. But many of the guys I work with were very skilled and talented guys. But that sort of annoys me, you know. Uh, I can't, I can't remember the name of that bloody actor. There was a bunch of actors that uh, all do drugs and everything. Oh, I was a genius. That's why he died of an overdose of heroin. And, yeah, and then bumming a working, working class guy, a blue collar guy. Oh, he's a bum, you know. He should have gone to college. I come up with these brilliant ideas. <laughs>